Hey guys, Jack Scalfani here. It's another audible.com sponsored episode. And I found out a buddy of mine told me that audible.com loves my product reviews and you guys love my product reviews. So guess what? We're doing Raptastic and I've been seeing tons of commercials on this product. It's going to be a quick product review. We're going to see if it really works. But first I want to tell you what I'm reading on audible.com. I try and keep them food related because I'm learning so much. Jacques Pepin, you guys familiar with that guy? Uh, famous chef. Uh, just amazing. In fact, Julia Child looks up to him. I didn't know that. I just found that out. So uh, I'm reading The Apprentice, which is his book, and uh, I've been watching him on YouTube. Go look on YouTube. Uh, look up Jacques uh, Pepin, like Jacques Cousteau, the way it's spelled. Uh, the guy is just amazing. Uh, it, it's hypnotic to listen to him with his accent. I love watching his videos on YouTube, and now I'm reading his book. So do me a favor. Take advantage of the link on the screen and read the book with me. Okay, you get a free audiobook, you get a free credit, you get to try it out for 30 days. Me and you will read it and we'll knock this out in a week. Right now, come in close because we're gonna find out if Raptastic really works. All right, so here it is. It's called Raptastic and it's a dispenser. Let me open this up and I have not opened it, I have not tried it. It is brand new in the wrapper. I don't like to do things that have been practiced, I'm not that kind of guy. I like to, uh, if I screw up, oh well. Just more entertainment for you guys, huh? All right, and these are like spring-loaded ends that come with it. All right, now I bought my generic plastic wrap. Normally I just tear it off and just use it like that. I hate this stuff. I can't stand this stuff. What happens? I'll tell you what happens. I pull it, I rip it off the box, and it all crinkles up together. So we're gonna check this out right now. And we're gonna put this in. Let's turn it sideways so you guys can see how to put it in, okay? So I'm gonna take the roll like this, okay? And then you're supposed to put this in here like this and you just kind of rotate it in and it gets in nice and snug. It's all spring-loaded. See that? That was easy. Same thing with this side, see? Oh, I think this is gonna work great. I'm excited if it does, I really am. And just put it in here, put it in there. There you go. That was so easy. Now I'm gonna pull this out just to get it started. All right, so here we go. So now it's supposed to be, can you see okay? All right, it's supposed to be anchored down pretty good. So then you just pull it and it doesn't stay. All right, you can't just pull it with two hands like that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use one hand here and one hand to hold it. There we go. All right, cut, cut. Am I missing something here? It's weird. Oh, look, there's a guard here. Okay, don't forget to take out this guard. That's why it didn't work. Test number two, now the guard is out. Here we go, ready? I'm gonna pull with one hand. There you go. I'm gonna press down and it's stuck. It didn't pop back up. Pop back up. There you go. It cut it. Okay, here's something that I always see people wrapping is watermelon. Now, I can't guarantee that the plastic wrap is gonna shrink around and stick. That's not Raptastic's fault, whether it does or it doesn't. But what I am concerned about is, here we go. I'm gonna pull it across, beautiful. I'm gonna press down gently and if you notice it's still not letting go of the plastic see it kind of sticks so you have to lift up here and pull away and it did it cut it perfectly so then you're just going to wrap the fruit like this oh it worked good okay let's see how easy it is to pop out it came out easy oh it comes right out this is easy now, you gotta get the smaller aluminum foil. You buy the real long ones, it's not gonna fit in here. I'm just telling you right now. Here's some I got left over. Luckily, I had some of the small. So let's put the ends on. Whoops, uh-oh. Look at that, see that? This is my regular leading brand Reynolds wrap. 
and yet it's not it's not going to work on this. Right, here's my really long stuff. Yeah, see, my really long stuff is too long for this. Ah, oh, it's too bad. Okay, let's check out the wax paper. Let's see if that's going to if let's see if that's going to work. Reynolds brand is a very popular wax paper too. Same company, but they got the right size holes, right? Right size holes. Yep. There you go. All right. There it is. Just want to cover it with wax paper. Sticks again, lift up, oh, lift up. It did not cut it. Ooh, it did not. It cut most of it. It did not cut all of it. Test number two, we're gonna do it one more time. Here we go. Wax paper, right? Push with both hands evenly. A little stuck again, but it did cut it. There you go. Okay, so let's review Raptastic. All right, so first of all, the number one problem is it sticks. When you press down on it, it doesn't pop up. That could be just my mine. It could be a defect in just the one I have. It worked good with the plastic wrap. I like it for the plastic wrap and I'm keeping this and using it for the plastic wrap. Uh, it did not work with my aluminum foil because either my roll was too long or the roll that fit in here was too small of a hole and I couldn't use the attachments. So I could not use this for the major brand of aluminum foil, at least in America. Uh, this also worked uh, with, the, with the wax paper and you have to press with both hands. So there you go. It works, I'm keeping it. If you know somebody who just hates doing plastic wrap like me, this is a perfect little gift. It's inexpensive, grab it at Target, Walmart, or wherever. And I will see you on the next episode. Don't forget, read an audiobook with me from audible.com. It's free, 30-day trial. Go for it. See you later.